Hey, what's up guys? So today I figured I would be doing a video on things iPhones need. And I'm actually still on the iPhone 5. Ew. I figured it was time to just go ahead and let Apple know some things that they need to add to their phones. So the first thing that I would really like to see is easier emoji access. Because every time I'm going to send a text and I want to use the heart emoji, I have to slide all the way down. When I want to do a kissy face next to it, I have to slide all the way back. I don't like that. So it would be really great if there was some kind of mechanic to make all the emojis that you use all the time in the front and you can have really quick access or you could search for your favorite something to make it quick simple and easy because right now with this update that just came out they're in completely different categories and it's just so confusing and takes at least three times as long to find the emoji that you want so apple fix it sorry to get hot and get getting heated another thing that really makes me very upset when i'm listening to music is i'll just be listening to my music and then i'll be sending a text message and i'll hit the little voice memo button and i you know me i'm just jamming out rocking you know and if the music goes off that's the most awkward three seconds of my life. It's also really awkward when you're listening to music and you're scrolling through your Facebook feed. Does anybody even use Facebook anymore? Because like, I think I'm the last one using it. And there's like a pop-up video or something and it, it just pops up by itself and my music goes off. And this stupid, dumb alien video plays like music needs to play no matter what. The Snapchat update, which lets you listen to music and record snaps at the same time. Bless you, Snapchat. Bless you. You are a saint. Thank you, Snapchat, for that update. The music needs to stay on until I tell it to go off, okay? I'm so sick of it. Apple, let music play no matter what. If I want to listen to music and watch vines, or if I want to listen to music and watch a video at the same time, then I need to be allowed to do that. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, you know, there's just one little feature of the iPhone that's been around for, oh, I don't know, the beginning of time. The little alerts you get when your phone is at 20% and 10%. Who knew? It's not like we have a little thing up here that says 20, 10, 9, 3%. It's just there. It's not like we can't, we don't look at it every two seconds, really. Literally every time I'm watching a YouTube video and the little 10, 10% thing pops up, my video stops playing and I get very aggravated. I want a way to disable the battery alerts. I need to disable the battery alerts forever and I'll never get them again. It's another notification that I'm not able to turn off. So I need to be able to turn off this notification. Gotta get my phone, I threw it. No one leaves me alone, like, ugh. Another really awesome thing that iPhones need is themes. This is what, the iPhone 5, we're on like, we're on the 6 iPhone now, and we don't have themes. Windows has themes, I'm pretty sure, don't quote me on that, but I think they have themes. Android, you can like select a theme. At least we have keyboards, we have keyboards. That's really all the customization we get. And honestly, I don't even use the keyboards because first off, Apple doesn't let the people that create these keyboards, they don't give them any say. They just design the keyboard. That's really all that they do. They just design the keyboard and and that's it, that's all they can do. So Apple, you need to get your stuff worked out because I'd really like to use this custom keyboard and I'd really like custom themes. You know, you just go in the theme store, get download a theme for 99 cents or a free one, have a new theme. It's just like a song, just like a podcast, video or music. It's so simple, come on. Speaking of battery percentages, the iPhone batteries, are a joke. I have the iPhone 5 and I'm pretty sure they had a recall on the batteries, but still that's no exception. If I have a phone and the battery stinks, I'm not gonna buy that phone again. I'm just saying I'm not gonna buy it again because what's the point of having a phone if it's always gonna be dead or always gonna be running low on battery or you always need the charger, blah, blah, blah. Look at Android. You have like, you can get multiple batteries and put them in Android phones. Like, come on, Apple. Come on, are you serious? Apple also needs to get rid of the freaking apps that you don't use. I have a, an entire folder full. Shall I, shall I read you some names? Compass, Voice Memos, Game Center, Newsstand, Health, Passbook, iBooks, Podcasts, Stocks, Tips, Apple Watch. There's a new Apple Watch app. I don't see myself buying an Apple Watch anytime soon. And if I want that app, I'll go get it myself. So Apple, you can stop feeding me your little suggested apps because I don't want them. If I did want them, I would go get them myself. So stop throwing them in my face. Stop taking up the very little storage I have on here and let's use it for something better. So you can stop 
being annoying, please. So stop being annoying. Ugh, so over it. Speaking of useless things, you know, there's this little thing in the music app that nobody uses. I mean, I guess, do grandmas use this? I don't even know. iTunes radio, is that still a thing? Like, let me see if we still have iTunes radio on here. Oh, yep, still there, still there. Haven't used it in probably years. So Apple, you need to get rid of the iTunes music playlist store thing because I don't use it, nobody uses it, Pandora, Spotify, SoundCloud, nobody uses it, I'm just being honest, like get rid of it, stop taking out my storage. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching this video, I will see you guys next time, don't forget to favorite, like, and share with all your friends, um, be sure to let me know what kind of videos you could, you, blah, 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 blah. be sure to let me know what kind of videos you guys would like to see, and I will probably make some.